I want you to try and relax as best you can. Let go of whatever else you are doing today. Be here as much as possible. Let your whole self arrive, your body, your mind, your breath. Check in with what you're feeling right now. Now I want you to think about the latest news. How has it been affecting you? Trump is a, is a bully, is someone who's, I, I've been marginalized my whole life. I understand what it's, it's like to be bullied in one form or another from people you know and also from strangers. And I, I, his comments are, are very divisive and, and ignorant and fear-based and even, you know, hateful and, and, you know, with the intent to incite uh, violence. He's a stand-up guy. He stands up with that strong chin. He looks forceful. Tells, tells it like it is. Well-dressed. I get angry about it because he's, no one has seen what he's really like and, and they're supporting him. And they're like blindly supporting him because he says what they want to hear. I suppose, okay, so being shot at, shout out of Europe, uh, just, just that in, as, a, as a thing, I think it's wrong. People got tired of being lied to, of being told how to think, and they're finally getting their power back by saying, you know what, we don't want that union anymore. We want to do things on our own. And that just make me really happy, you know, getting your power back. How do these changes in the world make you feel? Sad? Angry? Afraid? David Cameron. Boris Johnson and Nigel Farage. They're the ones that upset me the most. I'm really glad about it. I am just sort of like overwhelmed with the ridiculousness of it all. Try to locate this feeling in your body. Check in with your jaw, your chest, your belly. It's, it's in my head and my jaw because it's all tense right now. And my, my head, like I can feel right here, you know, yeah. it's tense. Sometimes it moves, but most of the time it stays here. Sometimes it can be in my chest. And you can't even breathe. It's like so, so much anger, so much... So much pain just crushing my lungs where you can't breathe. And maybe somehow I force it down to the stomach. I can't even feel it in my throat. Like, I can't even speak. And there's no point in speaking because nobody's listening. Focus in on it. Put your hands on it. Breathe into it. If this part of your body could make a sound, what would it be? Just... Uh, uh. I think it'd probably sound like that. Uh. Uh. Like a toilet bowl going down the drain. That's how it sounds like. Disgusting thing sounds like that. Think about those people making decisions for us, who are hurting us. Bring them into the room with us now. They are here. What do you need to say to them? You're ridiculous. You should have been there. You should have been up and you should have been taking care of me. If you really love me, you'd stop, stop trying to change me. 
I just mean like you're you're just a fucking witch. Like why the hell would you pick on little children? Like what what do you get out of it? Do you get like some sense of sick and twisted power? Are they paying attention to you? Look at me. Put your eyes right here. And you hear what I'm saying. Grow up. Open up. Open up your eyes. Open up your ears. And see what the fucking world is really like. There's no limitation to what you can say. You jumped the gun with me. You pushed me right into this. And thinking that I was some sort of rich man or whatever. I could have told you right from the beginning. I could have told you through a text message from the beginning. Listen, I ain't got a lot of money. So if you're looking for an older guy that has money, you, you, I got the, you got the wrong guy. Tell them again. You can shout if you want to. Tell them. I hate you. I hate you. You're fake. That's all you are. You said something, you did the opposite. Yeah, it's really simple, you're a liar. You lied to me. You lied to everybody. You said you wouldn't do it. You said you wouldn't ratify the, the Constitution. But you did. You did it anyway. We said no. And you did it. You are a liar. And then with no fucking response, no, no, me, no, 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 no reason why you just pack up and leave? Was there something more you needed to say to them? Say it now. You're a coward. You're a coward. And she was an immigrant. You know, she's, a, she's an immigrant, a Russian immigrant in this country. And, and what I get myself sometimes where I believe in Donald Trump and where he wants to fix the immigration, I'm going out with this, this woman, but I think that she's pure in her heart. But motherfucker, boy, did I get fooled. Did I get fucking fooled. Oh my God. She fucking played me. She played me so bad. I, that I'm still feel, I'm still having the effects today. Like a fucking asshole, I feel. You think you you think you it's okay to say anything you want to say or do anything you want to do to get promoted. It's the same fucking thing. It's all about you. It's not about us, it's about you. There are people in the media, in politics, who still have power over you. They are doing and saying things you know are wrong and you don't have any control over it. Yeah, but this is what's going on in this country because you, 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 like you take Hillary and she's like, sort of like the same way. She goes around, around the battle of, of, of the questions and stuff. You know, like and right, oh, right away she'll, she'll divert the question and go, well, don't vote for Donald Trump. She knows how to be a leader. She knows how to manage an office. All you know how to do is fire people and go bankrupt. We, we, we need you, and we need you to run this country right. We need you to change this country. We need you to turn this country around and get it better again, not going backwards. We need all that to, to, to change again, and we need all that. We, we, need, we need to be strong again, and we need, we need people to be happy, and, and enough with the killings and, the, and, and, and everything else that goes wrong in this country. You're not a real leader. Say it again. They can't hear you. You're not a real leader. You're not presidential material. You hear me? A liar. A fucking liar. That's what you know. Lying. If my life depends on it, if I have to like walk five miles to vote, I'm gonna vote against you. This man is, is a strong man. He's very mean, he means well. And, I, and he will do good for this country. Taking your time, stay with your feeling, 
and sit up when you're ready. You can punch, you can kick, you can scream. The leader needs to lead. You need to know how to run a country. Trap. You need experience. What experience do you have? You fooled me. You deceived me. Trap. I trusted you. I trusted you because you were all I had. All I had. about yourself. Okay. You're gonna pay for that. Good. I know. You're gonna pay but for that. I know. I know. You know that. that. You, you, know. you have to pay for that. Tell and you will. Because right. I shouldn't oh, have to. You will. Right. Now bring attention back to your breath. Can you deepen it? Can you slow it down?